everyone. Beth Flippo here. I am the VP of Embedded Software Development at Telegrid for many years. I've got Sam here too, who's our, one of our hardware engineers. And we got an email about a new product called uh, the Pocket Beagle. And we've done a lot of work with the BeagleBone Black and um, other type of single board computers. So we saw this new key fob computer, we decided to give it a shot. And this is actually the BeagleBone Black that we've done um, some systems with, some design. So according to their document, it's a very small pocket beagle that can do amazing things and we're gonna see some ideas. So Sam, open it up. All right, pull here. We got two of them because um, we do a lot of work in wireless technology and we're usually transmitting information back and forth between different systems. So whenever we buy anything, we usually buy two. So that is, wow. So the difference is this one has onboard flash, yeah. right? And this one does not. This one yeah. has to be programmed on the SD card right. fully. Um, we like to build a lot of our systems, use, specifically look for onboard flash so that in the military SD cards can break. And um, this isn't industrial grade temperature rated anyway, but even so, production products, if they have SD cards, can sometimes get damaged. So we look for that. But um, this is quite impressive how small it is. Yeah. It's a little system on a chip, so everything that it needs is all inside this little thing in there. Like all these, get all compacted into one little guy right. on there. And this is running a Linux mm -hmm. operating system, and um, it should be Debian, hopefully, because the original original BeagleBone uh, actually was Angstrom, <laughs> but um, but they've converted to Debian since then, and it should be pretty easy to get this thing up and running and the ideas are kind of endless. You could do sensors, you could do, you know, just transmission of different pieces of data between two points. It's actually very, very small. So. Robots, games, 3D printers. Really, that's what they say? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, we, um, we like to take these things that a lot of people think have just commercial robots and games and things like that, and we, we kind of push the limits <laughs> of what these things were originally designed to do. So it's a one gigahertz Linux processor, and each one was, what, 25 bucks? 25 bucks. That's amazing. And we usually build our own boards and things here, but now with single board computers, I mean, we could never compete on price for these things. So, good job to the BeagleBoard people. BeagleBoard.org is their website. All right, so we're gonna take these two boards back and we're going to program them and we're going to try to uh, come up with some ideas to test them out and we'll put up future videos showing some of our ideas and some things that we can do with these things. And if you have any comments or any ideas or things that you'd like us to try out, uh, please comment below, or you can always call Telegrid at 973-994-4440. Just ask for Beth, um, uh, one of the only girls here in <laughs> IT. Thank you. Thank you.